It's Roberto Clemente Day, and we have some new content here in MLB The Show, including a Roberto Clemente Day program where you can earn a free 99 overall Roberto Clemente. We've got double XP going on, a new event with some new rewards, new diamond duos in the pack shop, and then some new Tops Now cards to go over. So let's go ahead and start with the Roberto Clemente Day program. We got an icon, some stadium noise, five standard packs, a bat grip that we can see right here. And then the first player is a captain, Roberto Clemente program captain. It's this switch hitting Francisco Lindor right here. And you can see the captain boosts max of eight hitters from Puerto Rico or hitters to win the Roberto Clemente award on your squad for that tier three boost. And then pretty much same thing except for pitching. Jose Barrios is going to be that pitching captain. You can see the tier one, two, and three boosts for this program this captain card right here so moving on down you get some diamond duos balling is a habit christian vasquez 97 overall they're bringing back some charisma series cards adding them into this program we can see this christian vasquez right here some quirks on the card as well i'll probably use this card for my set four collections and then we have jose miranda another charisma series 101 106 contact 125 though max power Versus left-handed pitching. I'll probably use him for my set four collections. Maybe same thing with Enrique Hernandez right here. Look at all those positions that he plays. Every position pretty much. And then he also has no quirks on the car. But gets this 97 overall charisma series. And then we get a pack 36 of the diamond duos. We'll go over these dudes in a little bit once we get to the pack shop. And then we have this Roberto Clemente award winner Al Kaline. It looks like a new addition to the award series here on MLB The Show. I don't think they've had these in the past. 102, 111 for his contact, 78, 81 for his power, 94 fielding with these quirks that you see right here. I'm interested to see with the captain boost how these teams could look because plus 10 contact versus righties, plus 5 power versus righties, plus 15 power versus lefties. It could be interesting to see. What some of these cards end up looking like with that captain boost. But otherwise, you know, the 97s, I'll probably just be using all of them for collections. You get a jumbo pack. Carlos Carrasco gets a 97 card in here. A Roberto Clemente award winner. Four seam curve slider sinker circle change on the card. We can see the velo on the top right with the control and then the pitch break for him. We also have a Gary Carter award card for the Roberto Clemente award. 97 contact and power versus left handed pitching his quirks right there and then we have a great race of 98 pack at 85 points in the program and then a david ortiz 97 overall once you get to 90 points in the program 102 119 contact 101 and 90 first power 105 clutch on this david ortiz and then you get some ball ins you get this pretty cool looking bat skin for Roberto Clemente Day. I like the look of that. And then this beautiful card art. 99 Roberto Clemente. Let's hope the attributes are just as beautiful. Max contact versus each side. 93 power versus the same handed in his righties. 106 versus left handed pitching. 102 vision on the card with max 125 clutch. 95 fielding. Max arm strength and accuracy. 93 reaction. 70 speed. Plays right field, but he also plays second, third, left, and center. You can throw him around, maybe even put him at DH if you want to. And then he has these quirks that you see right here. I'm liking the look of this Roberto Clemente for a program card, especially if this program, which we're going to look at in just a second, isn't super hard to grind. I'm liking the look of this. I wish that this is kind of how the program rewards would have been looking all year. You know, rather than especially earlier on, all those 97s. But we got some moments. They're going to be worth one point apiece. And then there's an optional one at the end. But let's just count how many there are. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 points from the moments. But there's an extra one where you can get 10. And you need to hit one home run at Forbes Field. Oh, that's kind of funny. It's on a Hall of Fame difficulty. So instead of like an extreme program, they just have one optional extreme moment. Yo, I like that. That is actually a good idea, especially at Forbes Field. It's a hard park to hit a home run. They've had some moments there in the past. I like that, man. That is a cool addition, but otherwise just 14 points from the traditional moments. You got some missions. These are going to be worth five for most of them, seven for some of them. My math is not good to do this, but you got 
repeatable parallel XP with the program players from this specific program. You got innings with Pittsburgh Pirate players, total bases with any players in Diamond Dynasty, stolen bases with any players, home runs with any players. So really, this is just kind of use who you want and you're getting progress. Extra base hits with any players. Get on base with players from the program and also event batters i'm interested to see if that's just the rewards i'm assuming it is because it's the mike lowell and orlando cepeda so i'm guessing it's the rewards for the event when it says that and then strikeouts with cards from the program or the event rewards and then parallel xp with the award winners guys who have won the roberto clemente award which i'm assuming would probably include these specific award cards as well there's going to be a showdown where you can get 15 points towards the roberto clemente day program and then a conquest map where you can earn 20 points you see it right here and it looks like there's no time specific turns specific missions or anything which is always nice to see and i'm liking the look of the roberto clemente day program i think the end reward is pretty good and then i'm really liking that they threw in a fun optional moment too that's kind of nice to see there's also a roberto clemente day event going on we can see behind me the 12 win is a 99 orlando cepeda so we'll take a look at him in just a second but first you can see if you make it to five wins you get this alex claudio relief pitcher born in puerto rico 114 on the hits per nine 43 velo is going to be interesting with 99 break 97 control we see the velo in the top right as well as the control looking great on each of the pitches the break looking great on each of the pitches i'm somebody who will like this card because i still use the 99 adam wainwright as my wild card because of how good his control is especially on the higher difficulties at 10 wins you're going to get one of these rewind packs i'm probably going to choose john smoltz i sold him for a hundred something thousand stubs mike lowell at 20 wins 97 overall mike lowell 116 115 for his contact 85 72 for his power 105 vision 68 speed also born in puerto rico in this roberto clemente day event and then at 30 wins you can get one of the event rewind packs and then there's also that 12 win orlando cepeda charisma series for him max contact versus each side 96 power versus righties 115 power versus lefties 111 vision 125 clutch 62 speed on the card 70 fielding at first base you could maybe stick him in left or right field i'm not sure really why you would want to do that but otherwise could be a solid first baseman with that max contact and clutch and maybe even a designated hitter for your team that's the 12 win event reward in the pack store we have some new diamond duos you can see these marlins are the jerseys and then mike musina gets a great race of 98 series starting pitcher card oh man i don't think i'm gonna use this card pitch velo in the top right the control in the top right looking pretty good and the break in the top right but just that 101 hits per nine scares me a little bit but i liked mike musina's 99 last year i don't remember if his hits per nine was this low but i'll definitely give him a try if it was kind of near that because i did really like the musina card from last year super fractured him and then we also have a 99 overall dante bichette max contact and clutch and vision 109 and 102 for his power 92 arm strength and left field could also put him in center or right with his 67 speed and 74 fielding yeah i think i might be passing on the diamond duos this week but it's dante bichette and mike musina we have the start of the september tops now program you can see the flashbacks for this september tops now program hunter brown starting pitcher gonna be the first one that we have we also have a 95 overall Victor Robles from the Nationals. Gets a Tops Now flashback card in the September program. So does Matt Veerling for the Phillies right here. Gets his 95. And then Logan Webb also getting a 95 overall and part of the September Tops Now cards. You get a jumbo pack at six points. And you go all the way up to 18 for this first week of September. Getting some set four cards starting with Evan Carter that you see right here. There's also a Kyle Higashioka catcher card at Tops Now from the Yankees. We have a Hunter Goodman, Rockies, getting a Tops Now card, catcher secondary for him. Jacob Young going to be getting a card. I'm kind of surprised they don't have maybe a captain pack before you get any of these cards too. But Jordan Lawler from the Diamondbacks is getting a Tops Now card in 95. And then the 97 for now is going to be Jose Abreu from the Astros. 115, 106 contact, 109 and 102 for his power 
he's the final tops now card for the week you got the parallel xp with week one players and then some moments to start earning your progress and again double xp is going on it's a double xp weekend we have some new content coming in a week we got the pennant chase program with 99 overall legends and flashbacks on that day and then another program on the 29th as well as a new ranked season and new events so some content coming but otherwise we got the roberto clemente day program to grind a new event going on and some new tops now i'm curious to see what y'all think of the content i feel like for me i'm really just only excited to use that clemente card everything else once i get it it's really just four collections right now but i'm excited to try that clemente he's looking solid and i will see you in tomorrow's daily upload thank you as always for watching i hope you have a great rest of your day peace